Hey guys, I just want to say as a disclaimer <laughs> for the 144,000 part one um, that's up that even though I've explained what I think or how I think things will go down here very shortly, I don't know for sure, you know, Appa didn't come to me and say, tell my people, thus saith the Lord. That's just what I have gathered by um, my own intellect, but I have no idea. For all we know, we who have been called out to be the 144,000, maybe our ministries that we have been doing up to this point have been the work that we are supposed to do. And maybe when he comes for us, we're done. And that's it. And we don't have to come do anything during the tribulation. Um, read Psalm 18 and you'll see where King David is um, struggling and being attacked by his enemies and and then he gets translated and becomes a warrior. Does that mean it will happen in the natural or he was speaking of spiritual warfare for us? You know, you know for him he was really fighting but for us maybe it just means we've been fighting spiritual warfare and who knows, maybe we don't have to do it in the physical, in our translated bodies. I don't know, guys. I'm really tired, so, um, you know, I just wanted to say I, I am not claiming that everything I say in the video is that's how it's going to happen, because I don't know. So, I, I was getting ready to post the video, and I was like, you know, I wonder if it's possible that maybe we've already done everything we're supposed to do and that's it because you know a lot of people are talking about their, their ministries are over that they're being told that they're done that their work is done now whether that means it's done here um in our fleshly blood fleshly bodies and then in the spiritual will be doing more work I I have no idea so I just wanted to say that because I didn't want anyone to say you know you know to think that I think I have it all figured out and I know exactly how it's gonna go down because I don't so anyway just want to say that um, I hope the video blesses you in part two I'm gonna go into the detailed um, breakdown of how Revelation 7 and Revelation 14 um, can all can be describing the the literal Jew Jewish males who are virgins, and I still think virgin just means um you're you're not a harlot, <laughs> you're pure because you uh haven't defiled yourself with false doctrine. Um, so. Yeah, and in, in that part two, we will I'll go over how it the, the wordings and the meanings behind those words based on what the strong says definitely is um, also describing the bride. So with that being said, cutting this off. Peace and grace, and y'all bless everybody. Love you. Bye.